check out some of the other videos we've done. And, and we'll, we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Okay, get this Where's Star my Wars tea? Shirt off I need my tea! Hi, my name is Veronica Merrill. I'm one half of the Merrill twins, and um, this is Merrill Twins Exposed. Hi, I'm Vanessa, and I am the other half of the Merrill twins. <laughs> Get this Star Wars shirt off me. I hate Star Wars. Ugh, rope me. Hello, my name is Helen, and I am Veronica Merrill's assistant. So, Helen is my assistant. Helen is amazing. She, like, knows everything about my schedule, and she helps me get through the day, and I just really appreciate it. Okay, so what's on today's agenda? Well, now that you're done filming a video, we have lunch for you. Carol, is that my Fenty Passion Tea with two pumps raspberry, two pumps classic, and berry juice instead of water with no berries and light ice? Yes, I believe so. Hi, my name is Carol. Um, I've been working for Vanessa Merrill for about two weeks now, and um, she's interesting. Carol is my sixth assistant this month. Um, I'm really, really liking her, though. I think she's going to actually stay this time. She is such a good person but also really weird. I asked for light ice. This does not feel like it's light ice. Oh, thought, it's kind of heavy. I thought I asked for light ice. I'm so sorry, Vanessa. Gosh. You know, I bring her her tea. She just is very unappreciative. I always get it right, but this time I just messed up and forgot to ask for light ice and uh, just stupid Carol. Come on, Carol, get your stuff together. Oh my gosh, I'm so hungry. Thank you so much for reminding me, Helen. Here's your tamale and your glass of diet water. I asked for a tamale? Mm-hmm. I know everything about Veronica Merrill. I know what she likes, what she doesn't like. I even caption her Instagram pictures. I help her with a lot of things. So you have a busy day today. Next thing on your agenda is you have a phone call in about an hour for the secret project. Okay, phone call in an hour for the secret project. Got it. Oh my gosh. Helen, what would I do without you? You're a lifesaver. Carol! Carol! Have you seen Carol? No, I haven't seen her. The thing about Carol is that when I need her, I can never find her. It's like... She likes to play hide and seek or something. I really don't know. I can never find her. I don't know where Carol is. Come here, come here, come here. Why are you always in the bathroom? I'm always in the bathroom because I'm hiding and um, I've kind of adapted it as my workspace, like my little office. Like, hello, welcome to Carol's bathroom. Um, <laughs> Where's my fur coat? Oh, you don't have a fur coat. Yeah, I do. No. Yeah. No, you don't. Okay, well then let's go buy one. Wait, wait, no, you're not going anywhere. We have an important phone call meeting about the secret project. I don't know why, but Nessa always leaves at the wrong times, especially when there's business to do. Like, come on, Nessa. Um, hello, priorities. All right, Carol, so I need you to help me find a fur coat. If you see something you think that I would like, just let me know, okay? I'm gonna go. Since I've been working for Vanessa for two weeks, this is the first time she's ever taken me shopping with her. I don't know why she thought she had a fur coat already, but I've checked her closet multiple times and she does not. So I'm kind of excited to see what shopping with Vanessa is like. Oh, what am I going to do? I need Vanessa here. Helen, bring me my stress reliever. Nessa isn't back yet for the call, and I'm getting really nervous because I don't want to talk to these people alone about our secret project, but I guess I'm going to have to. Helen, what do you think I should do? Well, I think you should just take the call and say Vanessa couldn't make it. That's a horrible idea. Take him. I'm calling James. 
You know, I just love it when Veronica takes my advice. This is sarcasm. Does this look like fur to you? Feel it. That's not fur. This is fur. This is cute. Look at this. Feel that? Yeah, okay. Ooh, I like this. Thanks for helping me find this one. Ooh. This is the first time I'm taking Carol shopping and she's definitely the worst out of all the six assistants I've had. Carol, what are you doing? We're supposed to be looking for fur coats. She yells at me a lot. I think she holds in a lot of anger towards her sister. I think it's just about life. She's the younger twin, you know? I just, I feel like she has this grudge. I love James. We use him a lot for our videos, but like little did you guys know, he's my best friend and I just like really appreciate him. James! What's up? How are you? I'm come good. Come in, come in, come in. Hey yo, what's up? My name is James Lurum. I'm an aspiring actor and rapper and I'm Veronica Merrill's best friend. What's up? Oh my gosh. <gasps> this is amazing. I have to get this one too. So being a twin, you have a really special connection. And when I was shopping, I got this weird feeling that James was at my house. Carol, I think James is at the house right now. <gasps> James? He's just kind of creepy. I just feel like we need to get home. Yeah. <gasps> oh, silly me. I forgot my credit card. You're going to have to pay for these. find the fur coats and when it's time to go to the register to pay, Vanessa realizes she forgot her wallet and she turns and asks me to pay for the coats with my credit card. Okay, so this is what my problem is. I have a very important phone call meeting, but Vanessa isn't here to take it with me and it's about our secret project and I need her to be here with me and like I just don't know what to do and I'm getting really nervous and stressed out about it and I just... Can you just help me? So this is what you do. You take the phone call and you just say, Ness couldn't make it today. That is such a great idea. Thank you so much, I'm, James. You're I knew I could count on you. I, this is why you're my best friend. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I try sometimes. James is apparently amazing. You know, sometimes when you see a trail of ants that are all carrying crumbs, but there's that one ant that's not carrying anything. Be that ant. All right, it's five minutes until the call. Are you ready, Veronica? Okay, thank you, Helen. All right, you can leave now. But I just got here. I have to take this phone call now. Dude, I just got here and now she wants me to leave? I don't understand girls. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous, Helen. You'll be fine, just take the call. Hello? Hello, ladies. I am so So I get home and Ronnie and Helen are just glaring at me. We're home! How was the call? It was good. Are you even going to tell me what happened? No, you weren't even here. But we're a team, you're supposed to tell me these things. If we were a team, you would have been here for the call. But I needed a fur coat. A fur coat? Okay, that just shows me your true priorities and that none of this matters. Ugh! Well, on the bright side, I got a fur coat and I got Carol a fur coat too. Wait, one of these is for me? Mm-hmm. You're supposed to wear it at all times now. All times? Mm-hmm. You know, sometimes I underestimate Vanessa. Deep down, she's actually a good person. 
She's letting me keep one of her coats, even though I paid for it, and it's technically mine. Next time on Meryl Twins Exposed. You can't do that. We're in this together. You know what I can do? I can quit the Meryl Twins, and I'm going to quit the Meryl Twins right now. Get that out of my face. Carol. Yeah. Why do you look pale? I don't feel too good. <gasps>